Hi everyone, this is Fake Hair Mama. Thanks for joining me today. Today I am going to be cutting some bangs in Melina. She is in Flame Rooted and I got her from Paula Young. Her bangs come four and a quarter inches long, which you can see <laughs> they're too long for me. Um, normally my hairline is four fingers above my eyebrows. So you want to make sure that the hairline of the wig is on your, your natural hairline. Because I have made that mistake before. I had it pulled forward too much and then cut it. And when I went to wear it, the bangs were like up here. <laughs> and it just didn't look right. The, you know, can't really wear the wig that way if you wear it too far forward then it everything just doesn't fall right so let's make sure we have her I'm gonna be looking off to the side here a little bit because I have uh, a mirror over here all right so I have her on my hairline but I'm gonna want to like clip back these longer pieces of hair so they won't be in my way and I don't want to be cutting them because the there are some layers off to the side that I really don't want to touch because it's part of the wig style. But I may still have to trim some of these, a little bit of these longer pieces or maybe, probably not all the way. So I will leave part of it and I'll clip half of it. So same thing on this side. I can always cut more later, but once you cut it, that's it. Not gonna go back. Okay. So we have our hair sectioned off. Just gonna comb it a little bit. So now that I have the hair that I want to cut, I am going to twist it. Cutting it this way will leave like the outer edges longer and the middle a little bit shorter. So there's really, there's not going to be much to cut here. So I always start lower than when I, where I think I need to cut. And then, okay, so we're still not there. <laughs> still got at our hairline. Okay, we're gonna do that again. Twist it again. Okay, just a little bit. Another half an inch. Getting there. So I'm going to do just a tiny bit more because I really don't want the middle here to get too much shorter. And we can always uh, do some little snips to shorten the sides. 
Okay, so just like a quarter inch. Okay, so. Really not gonna touch this area anymore, but I need to do some more work here on the sides so they're not gonna be in my eyes. So I usually do <laughs> the dirty cut method, or I think that's what they call it. So I'm just doing some little uh, diagonal snips here. And then I may go back the other way. I think I got them where I want them now. A couple little pieces on my eyelashes. <laughs> Alina is such a beautiful wig. So I like to have bangs cover my wrinkles. <laughs> But she's much more wearable for me now. Don't have any hair in my eyes. Very pretty wig. And that's it. Very simple. Only took about five minutes or so. Just go slow and um, you'll get the results that you want. Thanks for joining me today. I hope this was helpful and especially helpful if you plan on getting Melina and you think you might need to trim the bangs. Please like and share this video and subscribe if you haven't already done so. We'll see you the next time. Bye.